All right, y'all. So I'm about to download the <laughs> the forbidden update real fast. But you'll see um, here, I got the cinema out. Still working well. Let's get this update. I'm doing it all in real time, so I want to put an end to all these rumors going around, man. So after I show you this, I'm going to explain like why, exactly why I'm showing you all of this. So go to about, install update. Give that a minute. <clears throat> Alright, update installed. Today is Friday, February the 25th, 2022. Go back to Cinema. You see I got all my third party apps here, Cinema and all the other good stuff. But yeah, so the reason I'm showing you this because I feel like information is, is, is starting to get confused. So there's some news recently, it's, it's, it's been going on off and on for like a while now, at least a year, about stopping Fire Stick updates. I really don't understand it. I understand it for like the YouTubers and the people putting out the articles because it, it gets people clicking and, and watching the videos because if you say, oh, like, you know, you need to stop Amazon from blocking your favorite apps, of course everybody's going to click on that. I understand that, but... It doesn't stop the third-party apps. What the updates will stop in the future is these launchers. This is like a launcher. So launchers actually modifies your Fire Stick. So it actually makes changes to your Fire Stick. When you download apps like these, it doesn't make changes to your Fire Stick. It's just simply installing an app. But I'll show you something else so it can, it can click better. So normally when we go to um, install these apps, we go to My Fire TV, go to Developer Options, and we only need apps from unknown sources on. Now whenever you turn on ADB debugging, this actually kind of opens up your Fire Stick or your Amazon Fire TV device for changes. So people that um, plug Fire Sticks to computers and make changes that way to modify it and actually jailbreak it, to do like some internal stuff that you really <laughs> don't know what's going on. They use this option right here. Whenever you install one of these launchers, you're using this option right here. So you're installing the app, and the app is going to make changes to your Fire Stick. Now Amazon, they like the, <laughs> their devices to work the, the way they're, they're supposed to work. So whenever you change the launcher changed the home page the device itself may not work the way it's supposed to work what kills me the most when people say oh stop block on uh, amazon fire stick uh, updates is you bought it from amazon so if they <laughs> if they're updating the device it's for a good reason they're not just updating it to like stop you from using these apps they're updating it because it was an issue they found and they had to re release an update to fix that issue. It's the same as your cell phone. If you got Samsung, iPhone, whatever, the update adds, I mean, it's self-explanatory. It updates your phone to a better working system. So, same with the Fire Sticks. But if I went into a rant and you didn't get what I was trying to explain, simply, long story short, you don't have to block the updates. When you block the updates, you you, you're actually holding back your device because the updates is going to help your device. And no, the updates will not uninstall or block apps like you see here. Like I showed you before and after I did update just now, for you just now, before and after I did update, I still have these apps. They're still working fine. All right, that's all I got for you. Again, I just want to put an end to these rumors. I usually don't talk about stuff like this, but my boy Mark hit me up on Facebook and asked me, like, oh, am I going to lose cinema? So I can see it's starting to affect other people, and it's, it's, it's all getting confused. So hopefully this shines some light on it. If you guys have any questions or you want to discuss this further, leave me a comment. But for this video, that's all I got for you. Much love to each and every one of you. I'm your Downloading Pirate, and I'm out.